after your iron armor, it looks all grimy, Shin. What have what? you been doing? It's like all rusty. What, the, what are you talking about? Well, I'm looking at it right now, and it looks like it could use a bit of upkeep. Um, it looks and maybe exactly you're not, the same as yours, Sips. I don't think you're on the ball, Shin. I, I think you're a disgrace, actually. Well, Look if at all it's the a rust. problem, why don't you give me a spit shine? Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, not with your fists. Well, uh, okay, I'm gonna get uh, the watery I, princess. There's is no give mechanic you a spit for shine. spitting in Minecraft. There's not even an emote. Like at least in World of Warcraft, you can spit on people. Uh, I don't know if you've ever done that, Shin. It's pretty fun though. People go wild. My God, they hate it. Yeah, it's what I you do when like you PvP somebody. You kill them yeah. and, then and then you, you spit, spit on them. them. And then they're, suddenly they're behind their desk. They take off their headset. They turn around to the wall and they make a hole. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've just I've just got a macro uh, uh, that I use that is um, slash me spits on you, so that you can hit it and everybody around you thinks that you've spit on them, but you're not actually <laughs> spitting on anybody in particular. Uh, that's a very good one, and people go mental at that too. You should see trade chat just like erupts in anger uh, when you spit on them, or a lot of people. Like if you just go to Orgrimmar and you spit on them like that, bam, you're guaranteed. A lot of angry people in the world yeah. of Warcraft. I know exactly and it's already a very angry world. I mean, it's based around the craft of war, mm. which is like an angry thing already. It's like Minecraft, but add, the war. You expect uh, yeah. to go then spelunking for war. Yeah, but then add spitting to the mix and then, wow. Spit, holy shit. Spitcraft. That, that's the next expansion, actually. That's what We went to spitcraft. BlizzCon and we got a tour of Blizzard Studios and, uh, and we saw inside uh, their office. They're actually working on World of Spitcraft. It's, yeah, it's, it's the new expansion. Well, I think I think it's a Minecraft crossover, isn't it? Yeah. Well, the uh, the big announcement at BlizzCon was that they're working on uh, Minecraft version 1.8, which yeah, oh, it's a lot be of good. people didn't think was going to happen. Like 1.7 was supposed to be the last one. I can't. But wait. I guess I guess like I guess Mike Morheim convinced Notch that like you just got to go for one more, another one expansion. More. So, yeah, and then I think 1.9 is going to be like the Spitcraft stuff, which is like crazy. I, I, I just it. can't wait for that. Holy shit. It's I would have nuts. loved to be a fly on the wall for that conversation. Um, yeah. Chris, I don't know if we're really ready for 1.8. Shut up, Mike. <laughs> we're more than ready. <laughs> oh, fuck. An impression every time. My God, I can't. Uh, I, I just. I cannot. I can't hold myself. It's too sexy. It's. It, it's. It's. It's too much. That's. I. I found myself very moist when Mike was on stage. Actually, I'm not ashamed to say because he's a. He's a powerful specimen. <laughs> he is. He is a. He is. He is a. Indeed, a powerful specimen. That's a, that's quite a way to describe a man, actually, Shin. A powerful specimen. Yeah. Of the human race. A powerful Just, specimen. What a fantastic way to describe somebody. Holy shit. Well, it's ever since he won, like, the rights to Minecraft from Notch uh, via arm wrestle. Yeah. Is that how he won it? Oh, my God. Yeah. That's how... A lot of people don't know this. A lot of people think, like, the, world, the, the big business is run on money. But the truth is, it's run on testosterone and power. And, and one, so, yeah, one a hostile takeover isn't like a financial thing. It's actually like a, a fisticuff fight. It's a hostile takeover. It's like a bar brawl. Like the boardrooms Whoa. get together. The shareholders get together. They have a big like death match. They bring out like chains and whips. And they grenades. wrap themselves in like barbed wire and yeah. everything. And holy shit. Through the table, suplex, their fists with DDT, glass glued to them. Yeah, out the window like, of the twenty-first story and stuff. It's like a cage wow. match on like on like crack. It's crazy, but you know that this is how big businesses is works, and it and it makes sense because it's survival of the fittest at the end of the day, isn't it? We're about evolution, and um, and punching people in the face to take what's theirs. Yeah, I love that. I love punching people in the face. And God bless. I especially like taking what's theirs as well. I think that's the greatest. Yeah, although I don't think that's the greatest. I think it's quite mean. Uh, unless you use bees. If you use bees to take things from people, then that's creative enough for me to say, okay. What, just like uh, like little bee thieves? They just like uh, yeah. run around and steal stuff from people? Well, that's you've crazy heard, shit. You've heard of cat burglars. Where do you think that term came from? In, in Egyptians used to worship cats because... Um, they had the ability to train them to be kind of master thieves. So you'd see these little cats with like like Zorro masks Ooh. and swag bags, 
just like going across the rooftops, going to people's houses, taking their jewelry, stealing their records, their Barry Manilow records, all that oh stuff. Oh, God. It was all prey for the, uh, for the elite cat burglars of the Egyptian empire. <sighs> they, they, they were a gruesome bunch. A gruesome bunch. Oh, oh here they we They loved go. makeup too, didn't they? Egyptians. Yeah. Oh, God, yeah. They loved makeup. Um, Shin, I've done it. I've got a mining turtle. It? Yeah. Oh. I've actually got a mining turtle. I'm oh, gonna, gonna, I'm gonna are we going to set this it? baby? Yeah. I'm going to try it out. We, Sweet. we should try to find somewhere like safe that we can try it out. Though, wait, cause... wait, we should sleep. The moon's just come up. We don't want to get ra- uh, 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 attacked. Okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. I'm going to bed. Okay, I'm joining you. Let's do oh, it. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, oh look, uh, as, I, as I black out watching the moon rise over our crops. <laughs> I oh, wake up in a field with uh, a man's <laughs> arm in my jaw and... Um, and I'm wearing <laughs> red red shorts, spandex with the American <laughs> flag pattern on them, and I'm wondering to myself, what the hell happened to me? What, what a night! What, what a, a night! What a night to remember or or well, forget. forget in this <laughs> case. Yeah. Okay, okay walk so, me through this. Okay, well, I don't really know what I'm doing. We're gonna try this out for the first time. So apparently, uh, wherever this thing starts, it's gonna come back up to and dump stuff into an inventory if there's one adjacent to it. So I've set up a right. chest here. Yeah. I put the turtle down. Oh, yeah. shit, look at this. Oh, look at him. Oh, look at him. He's like, his arms are pickaxe. His arm is a pickaxe. Yeah, he's. I'm going to fill him up with coal fuel cells. Uh, and he's got all these inventory slots here. Look, I'm on Turtle OS 1.5, Holy uh, which shit. is like the operating system for this turtle. Now, I think iPhones use that as well, don't they? They do, yeah. It's uh, it's kind of like the cotton candy Android version, but this is like the turtle version. So uh, fire this baby up. I want to see this guy in motion. Okay. Well, we have to put uh, a command in. So I think we want this guy to excavate, uh, which will make him dig in like a whatever by whatever straight down to bedrock level. Okay. Um, thing. So I think if we just actually type in excavate. And let's say like we want it to be like nine by nine. I think I think you can do that. I think you could do like uh, nine, just like this. Excavate nine, and he'll excavate in a nine by nine pattern uh, until he hits bedrock. Let's do it. Let's okay, do it. Try. He's out of fuel. Wait, <laughs> what, what? How did he what? run out of fuel? No. Where, where do we Where do we fuel him up? How do we actually fuel him up? He's out of I fuel. I think there's a hole at the front. Just put coal in that. Right? It's like a letterbox. Just He's he's out of fuel again. What? Okay. I'm going to How much fuel have you put in? Oops. I think well, I put it into his inventory, but he doesn't have it. Maybe uh maybe he needs it like I wonder maybe there's a different port. Well, I put it I I I definitely put coal fuel so maybe maybe he oh. doesn't Oh. Sorry, I picked go? that up. Sorry. I, it's it's you back now. Fucker. Cold dust. Maybe that might work. I'm sure this is supposed to work. No, okay. Do you have like a piece of coal? Um, I can go and get one, I think. Maybe. I'll go and see if there's one in the generator. But we always use it when we get it. So, no, there isn't any in there. Let me go and see. Oops. I keep pressing E to escape, but it actually puts a command in. Yeah, that's the only thing. I just don't... Unless there's like some other... But apparently, if, if this guy picks up stuff he can use for fuel, he'll hang on to it and use it as backup fuel. So that's why I thought maybe just putting it into the actual inventory would work. But I guess not. It doesn't appear to be. We got no fuel up here. All the coal that gets sucked up was going automatically back into the quarry. Oh. So, yeah. Okay. We could put Rocky in there. He could work as fuel. Yes. Come on, baby. Sh- yeah, shove Rocky in there. Why not? Oh no, I'm been juiced. I'm been I'm total juice. Rocky's ready to rock and roll. I think there was some coal like right down here. I'm just gonna go get one piece and try this out just to make sure. Do you remember those chocolate bars? Rocky Rocky chocolate bars? No. Okay. Were they good? No, they were horrible. <laughs> really? Yeah. God, you wouldn't expect. I mean, like they made those chocolate bars after Babe Ruth called Baby Ruths. Yeah. And they were delicious. That's another thing about America, actually. I didn't realize. All the candy over there is like, it's like super old. There's like all these candy bars and sweets that are basically, 
just like from like the 50s and 60s and they're actually quite bad but like i guess people like still like them for nostalgia or something why what's what's so bad about them i don't know it's just like you they're just weird do like some investigative reporting and and found out that they're like really bad yeah i, I was watching a panorama episode where they got inside like uh, a candy factory oh oh shit oh he's going the only thing is though is that oh shit oh look at him go what's he doing oh, well shit Oh, what? That was me. Sorry. You you put that there. Oh yeah. look, so he's got a piece of wood in his inventory. So um, well, did, he's digging. He's digging grass. I so might it's... have actually just spent a lot of time making coal fuel cells uh, for nothing because they don't seem to actually work with him. Oh, <laughs> and I think it may be because it's uh, Yogg's craft and it's old and it's using old versions of mod packs that I didn't realize. Oh uh, yeah. Oh no, he's going. No, that was the, the no, sapling. He's... He's going nine stop by nine. Him. He's so a menace. He's, he's a menace. A, he's quite the menace, actually, isn't he? He's got to stop at some point, though. Look I think this. we should. Oh, 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 look. Oh, he's coming back. He did not He did not like the tree. Is he going to drop stuff off in here? Is that what he's doing? Oh, yeah, he did. He just dropped everything off in he's, there. He's, I think he's, he's, oh, he's waiting, waiting for, for fuel. fuel. Ah. Oh, nice. If we, put, if, if we put fuel in the chest, will he take it out of the chest? Let's try that. No, I don't think he will. Do you have any coal? Uh, no. Where did you get he, the coal from? Did you dig it up? Yeah, I just digged it up. Uh, I don't see it any up. down here. Digged. <laughs> you dig, dig, digged up the coal. Yeah. I digged it, was, it up. I, I, digged, digged, I good. digged it up. I thought it was more better than going um, hey, down and, and dugging it up instead. Shove this up in your pipe bowl. It's like fucking best as coal fuel. fuel cells don't actually even work. We're going to have to use them for something else. Because apparently what are they, they used produce... for then? Oh, you well, can tell. You can press If you press R or U on it, I think it's U on coal. I'll, I'll do this. Let's see. Coal... Coal fuel. R or U. It's not here. What is coal? Here we go. If you press, yeah. H coal cell, R. That's how it's made. U is what it's used for. Okay. It's used in an extractor to get a coal fuel cell. Okay. That's yeah. what I'm looking for. Okay. So coal fuel cell is used. Oh, it won't, it won't tell me. Okay, it won't, great. It won't tell me. <laughs> <laughs> um, so good. Oh, look. I, th I, th I think it's trying to use these. Is it? But it can't. Yeah. It really cannot use them. That's it, a real it, shame, actually. Will it find plenty of coal? How much coal did you give it? And how, how far did it go with it? It did all that on one piece of coal. So okay. I think with a couple more, and then potentially it can find its own coal, uh, hmm. its own supply of coal. I don't know if it's going to be better than the quarry. I mean, I think it would have been a lot better with the quarry than the quarry if we were able to use the um, the coal fuel cells, but because we can't, I'm not sure if it's going to be any better. But, yeah. Um, well, it was fun actually putting all the machines together and actually it was making um, all the stuff. We've got coal fuel cells that be... might be useful for something, right? They've got to be used for something. Well, they're worth EU, so um, we should be able to use them in in IC2. I mean, the fact that they're actually in the mod pack, sort of. Yeah. You know, you you'd think that maybe you could just shove them into like a IC2 generator or something like that. Oh, right. We could just and put then, then we could put them in the bat box, I think. Or, or maybe, like, oh, yeah, like a generator. Yeah. Yeah, yeah maybe. Then we'll each, save them for that. I've got eight cells and each one is worth about 16,000 EU. So okay. it's got it's to be worth using on something or hopefully can be used on something. And then if we can just get some coal, we can just feed the turtle, little Timmy. And uh, Timmy. well, actually, no, why is everything called Little Timmy? Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. Well, because I think... Timmy is just the ideal name for something that's little. Well, the quarry isn't actually that little, but the mining turtle is definitely uh, little. T Timmy. It is. In fact, he's a menace. So I'm kind of leaning towards uh, Dennis as a Ten name. Tennis. Tennis. It's like, tennis. It's the best of both worlds. Timmy yeah. and Dennis. Timmy and Dennis. Tennis. Combined. Um. All right. So coal. Get some coal, and then I think if we got like, I don't know, maybe like ten pieces of coal, possibly. Yeah. Coal dust doesn't work either. Oh uh, no. Kind of annoying. Yeah. Fucking Timmy. I don't know what version of. Uh, I guess what's it? Mining turtles come under computer craft, don't they? I uh, yeah. So whatever they version do, of computer craft is in this mod pack, obviously is uh, outdated. Is old. And yeah. a little bit outdated and not in sync with uh, the latest in IC2, which is kind of annoying, actually. But It's a shame. 
Uh, we might be able game. to do it, use this kind of stuff in the space program, though. We It'll might probably be more might. efficient than using the quarry. We definitely uh, need to get to the moon, apparently, though, like super soon. So we should put all our efforts into getting like a NASA launch bay and all that stuff, and, and that's cool. Yeah, but that's and then another once, show. Once once we're up there, uh, we can ship all of this cool dirt that we're going to be making uh, up to the moon uh, and make it um, really dirty. <laughs> That's oh, that's yeah. the goal. We just want to dirty up the moon. So that's my one can. true pairing. Yeah, Dirt and coal. We're, we're just gonna make a whole bunch of mud huts for the girl gods when we're up there, just to show we off. Should. How Actually, awesome I heard are. a thing. I heard a thing. Like if we t if they if they have a launch pad, but not a rocket, and we take our rocket to their launch pad, yeah. we can go to the moon where they will land. So then we can oh. booby trap it, so yeah. that when they go with their rocket, yeah. they explode or something. Oh, it'd be great. Or they, we could just put like a big patch of lava and then they'll have no choice. They'll be like, oh shit, no, the wrong trajectory. We're just going to land in lava and melt and die. And oh, then no. we're going to be able to laugh our butts off at them, at their misfortune. Oh, yeah. They're going to be so angry and it's going to be so, so funny. It's so funny when people get angry. <laughs> yes. It's just hilarious. It's, so it's that's going to be good. I'm looking forward to that. I love, Especially. I love making them angry. Um, so yeah, so coal. If you can find some coal, Shin, uh, we're we're in yeah. the money, uh, and we'll keep looking for coal, and uh, we'll fuel up uh, our little turtle man. And uh, I wonder if the biofuel stuff is actually going to work. Then, if the um, if the coal fuel stuff didn't work, maybe the bi biofuel stuff won't work either. Uh, it won't. Um, the biofuel stuff definitely won't work because it's um, it's build craft. It's not. It's not. Oh. Um, it's not anything. So yeah. So well, at least with the biofuel stuff, we could potentially use it in like the quarry Ooh, and stuff, though, right? Or the engines, sorry, the Sterling engines and stuff. That's true. Yeah, exactly. Well, no, no, we can't use biofuel for those. Well, no, 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 we can. No, no, that's the thing. We can't use it in Sterling engines. What we use it in is something called a um, biogas generator. Oh. Or biogas engine, and oh, oh god. So yeah, we plug that in, and, and, and biofuel is super efficient. It's like the best build craft power you can get. And it, it works really well with forestry. So, And I'm really good at farms and shit because I've just been doing <laughs> a lot of that recently. Man, holy shit. Talk about tooting your own horn. Jeez. Well, you know, I, I don't like to brag, but I'm like hot shit. What can I say? Yeah. Oh, my God. It I'm looks literally like a steaming poop. You've made like uh, almost the Van Halen symbol up here with this platform. It looks very yeah. uh That's what I was going similar. for. Oh, okay. I see. Uh, well, good job. Okay, Shin. Well, uh, let's wrap up there then. It's been another exciting day at uh, at the Sipsco Dirt Factory platform, Heimer, Dinger, Donger, whatever oh, you call it. Has. it. I'm really enjoying Dirt Factory, actually. I'm really enjoying kind of getting things up and running. But we should, shouldn't should forget the name of the series, right? Dirt Factory. We need to, we need to start constructing... Um, Our Dirt Factory. Some kind of dirt production. Yeah, 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 yeah. We need to be able to get this stuff out to the masses. We need and to. And start shipping it. Over and, to um, the space program, I think. And receiving it, too. We need a big yeah. receiving bay, as well as a big shipping bay. Because I figure important. if we build a big ship, right, either yeah. side, somehow we'll be able to get dirt across. And I think oh. it's a good way to bridge the gap between universes. Oh, That's what we need to do. A universal bridge. Oh. 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 Okay. Does that, does that, make, you, does that make you horny, baby? A little too, a little too horny, actually. Yeah. Um, oh. Surprisingly, um, yeah. To the point where actually now I, I have to go. Um, bef before I, before I make a mess. Okay. Like a, an excitement mess. Do you want me to shake that for you? It's like a very excitable piss, I guess. Okay. If, if you think about it that way. Okay. Uh, well, see you next time then. <laughs> On that Bye. Note. <laughs> Bye.